can I repay the Lord for all the good done for me? I will raise the cup of salvation and call on the name of the Lord. Psalm 116. Father Mike was born on September 29, 1943, the eighth of ten children of William Aloysius Ruane Sr. and Clementine Victoria Haney Ruane. His father served in France in World War I, and later died when he was four. But the angel of the Lord encamped around his mother and delivered her. A woman of faith and a strong mother, she remained a widow for 58 years, a prudent steward over her household. Two of their sons, whom he never knew, died shortly after birth. Father Mike grew up in East Baltimore with one sister, Anne, and six brothers, William Jr., Charles, James, Eugene, Peter, and Francis. They served a time in the Navy, Army, and Marines, and Eugene in the priesthood before marrying and starting families. And yes, he is uncle to dozens of nephews and nieces. Father Mike remembers attending a Lutheran church vacation Bible school when he was seven. From 1949 to 1951, he attended St. Paul's School with the Franciscan Sisters, and from 1951 to 1957, attended St. Dominic's School, taught by the Daughters of Charity. He was an altar server, a member of the Safety Patrol, and a Boy Scout. In 1957, he entered St. Charles College High School in Catonsville, Maryland, beginning life as a seminarian under the direction of the Sulpician Fathers. He captained intramural sports teams, sang second tenor in the choir and glee club, and was a cast member in college plays. He was given a house job in the mission store and was an officer in Our Lady's Sodality. And in June 1963, he graduated with an associate's degree in liberal arts. Afterwards, he was sent to the major seminary at Mount St. Mary's in Emmitsburg, Maryland, under the direction of secular priest, and earned a bachelor's degree in philosophy and master's degree in theology. When through one man, a little more love and goodness a little more light and truth comes into the world, then that man's life has had meaning. Father Alfred Delp Father Mike was ordained for the Church of Baltimore by Lawrence Cardinal Sheehan in the Cathedral of Mary Our Queen on May 17, 1969. Of the nine ordained that day, he is the only classmate both still alive and active. After ordination, Cardinal Sheehan appointed him as associate pastor at St. Agnes Church in Catonsville, Maryland, 
where he served from 1969 to 1977 as the Director of Liturgy, the Catholic Youth Organization, and the Confraternity of Christian Doctrine. In addition to preaching, teaching, and healing ministries, he was a catechist and adult educator, guiding the parish through the changes inspired by the Second Vatican Council. Active in ecumenism, he served as an officer in the Catonsville Ministerium and as a board member of the Suburban Pastoral Counseling Clinic. His second appointment was to Our Lady of Hope Church, formerly St. Adrian and St. Mildred Parishes in Southeast Baltimore County from 1977 to 1988. Archbishop William D. Borders appointed Father Mike, pastor at St. Michael, Poplar Springs, Mount Airy, effective December 28, 1988. The Western Vicar, Bishop P. Francis Murphy, presided at the Mass of Installation on May 28, 30 years here at St. Michael. Father Mike has supported a ministry of shared responsibility, accountability and transparency in collaboration with the church staff, corporators, and parish leadership in building up the body Christ. He delegates and entrusts, but also initiates and takes charge. He has ministered to the spiritual and temporal needs of our parish family by supporting traditional ministries and introducing new ones such as the pastoral visitors and funeral luncheons. He encourages the called and gifted to take leadership in the five mission areas of liturgy, evangelization, faith formation, stewardship, and service and justice. In his preaching, teaching, and healing ministries, he invites the pilgrim people of God of all ages to love and serve one another in Christ Jesus to the glory of God the Father, and in the presence and power of the Holy Spirit. Father Mike promotes the spiritual and corporal works of mercy. With the prayers, financial commitment, and work of parish leadership and staff, we have increased the expansion, winsomeness, and attractiveness of our grounds and facilities and opened our doors to archdiocese workshops and rentals. By faith through grace, Father Mike continues to be a channel of God's redeeming love, life-giving words, and healing presence in helping people on their journey to eternal light, life, and love. For 50 years, through the ministerial priesthood and the sacramental presence of our High Priest, Jesus Christ, he has brought the gospel to bear at significant turning points in the lives of the faithful. At birth, growth, maturity, decline, and death. Contemplata Elise Tredia. He hands on to others the fruits of contemplation.
pray, brethren, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father.